Today I'm going to show you how to make powerful conditional logic in fill-out forms to hide certain fields based on previous form inputs. In this case, I've made a customer satisfaction form that I'm going to send to users to ask them how well we did on our recent feature update. I have a question asking them if they actually want to leave a rating, and then I have my actual rating scale here. I'm going to go ahead and pick my rating scale, and I'm going to show this only when this is set to yes. So I'm going to go ahead and add conditional logic. And in fill out, you can reference any previous form input by going into the specific page. And then in this case, I want to select my rating question, whether they want to leave a rating. And I only want to show this when this is set to yes. So right now it's visible, but as soon as I hit no, they don't have to leave a rating. I want to show another field conditionally that is going to give some indication based on how well we did on the score. So I'm going to say, wow, thank you, in the case that we get a really good score from our users. So I'm going to, sh again, show this component only when they did want to leave a rating, so they said yes. And I'm going to add another condition that says that the rating that was left is actually greater than, let's say, 90% in this case. We have to do really well. So right now, it is not visible. I'm going to add another alert. But in this case, it's going to be a warning that says, sorry, we couldn't help. This we only want to show when the score that they gave is lower than 80 or 90%. So again, I'm going to ask. I'm going to say if they said yes to the rating question, and also if the rating that they gave us was less than 90% in this case. Or we could even say less than 50%. So I won't show anything in a certain range. So let's go to preview mode and try this form out. So right now I have nothing visible because I haven't said that I want to leave rating. I'm going to say my name. And I'm going to say, yes, I want to leave a rating. In this case, I have nothing shown because I'm sort of in that middle range. Now I'm going to give a really good rating, and we see our success message. And then I'm going to give a not so good rating, and we get a different message here. I'm going to go ahead and submit this, and we could see that we have our results here with our not so good rating and that we did want to leave a rating. So that's it.